Hello and welcome to channel Unlocks Hub. Today we received an iPad Air 4th generation currently locked to Apple ID and it is also marked as lost and erased. This is an iPad Air 4th generation which is the latest iPad Air model from Apple and it is currently linked to an Apple ID and you can see it is activation locked or iCloud locked. This iPad is also lost and erased. It says enter the Apple ID and password that were used to set up this iPad. So I'll be showing you how to remove the iCloud lock or activation lock permanently on this iPad Air 4th generation. You can see that here. It says iPad Air 4th generation. And it is running on iOS version 14.4.1 and I'll be updating it to the latest iOS version which is the iPad OS 14.6. Without wasting much time, let's begin the video. Before that, click on the subscribe button and also press the bell icon if you haven't done that already. If you need the package, kindly mail us on our mail address given in the video description. The first step is to click on the flash and jailbreak option. Click on the pro flash there. And now you have to put the iPad into DFU mode. You can follow the on-screen instructions given here or just follow this video. Let me show you once again, this is the latest iPad Air 4th generation and you can see it says iPad Air 4th generation and I'll be removing the iCloud activation lock permanently. Watch until the end of the video to find out if the iCloud lock is possible on this latest iPad which is using the Apple A14 Bionic chip. The first step, let's put the iPad into DFU mode. To do that, press the volume up button, volume down button and hold the power button until the iPad turns off. So once that is completed, hold the volume down and the power button simultaneously for about 5 seconds. Let go of the power button, keep pressing the volume down button. And you can see it says iPad Air 4th generation connected in TFU mode. Let's begin the first step. Click on the query compatible SHSH option here. And wait for it to complete. So once that is completed, click on the import firmware option. And let me just show you. Select the Unlocks Hub iOS 14.6 iPad Air 4th Generation .ipsw and click on Open. You can see the same here. It says current firmware is Unlocks Hub iOS 14.6 iPad Air 4th Generation. Click on the Flash option here. Now just wait for the installation to complete. This whole process takes somewhere around 20 to 25 minutes. Make sure you have enough time to do it. Also, if possible, make sure you use the original Apple USB cable. So, I just received this iPad today and it is a C-type connector. I don't have the original Apple C-type connector. So, I'm using a third-party cable which is very trustworthy. If you have the original cable, make sure you use it. If you don't have it, no problem. Use a good quality uh, third-party USB-C type cable, it should do the trick. And also I have selected the uh, retain users data so that I don't have to enter the Wi-Fi password once again to log in. If you need the package or the files, 
kindly mail us on our mail address given in the video description. Just check out the description right below this video and you will find our mail address. Do drop in an email and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Watch until the end of the video, do not skip any step. If you have any doubts or questions, kindly ask in the comment section. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and also press the bell icon to get notified as soon as we post a new video. We have done multiple videos on the latest iPhones as well. Make sure you check it out. We have done even on the latest iPhone 12 series. So this method works on all iPads including the iPad Pro, the iPad, iPad Air and the iPad Minis. Let me just check and uh, sorry about that it is asking don't erase users data let me click on yes and now it will start the installation procedure. So putting any latest Apple uh, iPads or iPhones into DFU mode is a little bit tricky. If you don't get it for the first time, make sure you try it one more time. Just restart the device and keep trying two to three times and you will definitely get into recovery mode or the DFU mode. Also this whole procedure works only on the DFU mode and does not work on the recovery mode. They both are completely different. So make sure you put your device into DFU mode only. And yes, it is now installing. You can see here it says um, current firmware is unlocked hub iOS 14.6 iPad Air fourth generation dot IPSW so just wait for the installation to complete
and you can see the iPad is now turning on. Just wait for it to turn on completely. Do not skip any step. Do not unplug your iPad also or you may break the iPad. And yes, now we are in this iPad. You can see it says iPad Air 4th generation in normal mode. Let me set up this very quickly and show you if the iPad is iCloud free or if there is iCloud lock still present. Let me go through this very quickly. I'll be setting it up later. And it says welcome to iPad. Let me click on get started. And yes, now we are inside this iPad. And this is the same iPad with which I started this video, the iPad Air 4th generation, which is the latest iPad from Apple. And also you can see it says sign into your iPhone. I can log in with my own user ID and password. You can log in with yours. That is not an issue. And yes, everything works in this iPad without any problem. This is the same iPad Air 4th generation and this same procedure works on all latest iPad models including the iPad Pro series. This iPad Air 4th generation uses A14 Bionic chip so all the devices which uses the same chip can still be unlocked. If you need the package, do mail us on our mail address given in the video description. If you have any doubts or questions, kindly ask in the comment section. Don't forget to click on the subscribe button and also press the bell icon to get notified as soon as we post a new video. Thank you for watching guys. Have a great day. Take care. See you in our next video.